good afternoon. It's kind of late. But if you guys are new to the channel, my name is Austin, and you guys are watching Street Savages. So today on uh, the channel, I haven't uploaded in about a month, in a week or so, so about five weeks. Uh, the last video I uploaded was Mike getting delivery of his McLaren, and I be the first person to ride in it. Uh, yeah, it, it was lit, let's just say that. So, since then, uh, before then, actually, the, the beam, here is my 2000, uh, BMW 528i, uh, but before that, everything was okay with it, it was chilling, and then one day, the battery kept dying, I was like, ah, nah, whatever, it's been sitting for like a week, maybe the battery just died, because my dad did daily it for a little while, but then he stopped, uh, but anyway, so... He was dialing in it, it was running okay, and then the battery kept dying, so we kept charging it, charging it, charging it. Well, then one day we went to the firehouse, and all of a sudden we shut it off. We are like, oh, it should start right back up, and it didn't. So the battery was dead again, so, which was really weird, actually, because I really didn't expect the battery to be dead. There was no reason to. We just charged it. But ended up, come to find out, uh... The Beamer has a bad battery. Now, yes, I do have a new lighting system right, in it. I don't know what happened. My phone shut off. Uh, it said I had storage, no storage or something, so I deleted a couple of videos. We were all right. So, anyway, the battery is dead. I do have 12-inch kickers. I got a new lighting system in it. And, uh, well, actually, double 12-inch kickers. I only had one at the start, but then I ended up buying a two of them. So, let's say that. Uh... But anyway, so I'll show you guys the lighting that I put in. Uh, I might, if you follow me on Instagram, uh, which is Dermax underscore diesel underscore power, you would have saw the lighting. But I will uh, show you guys right here on the video. And I will explain what else is wrong with the Beamer. And it probably will get fixed here soon. I'm not really too sure right. yet. So here's the Beamer. Full leather interior. It's got an upgraded sound system. Sounds really good. So if you come down here... Uh, I know you guys really can't see here. Let me turn on the light. <clears throat> and I didn't make it much better. Uh, but anyway, so there's a button right here where my finger is. Click it. Oh. Click it. There you go. And we got lighting. Uh, it might be able... Yeah, you can't really see it back there. Oh, there you go. That's in the back floorboard. Driver's seat. Passenger seat. And the back floorboard. Right there. So that's that, and it's got that. Uh, I would pop the hood, but like I kind of got my garage down, it's already locked and everything, so I don't really don't feel like doing it. But anyway, so if you come to the front, even though I don't have the hood open, uh, around this area and like right here, uh, there is a coolant, and the coolant hose has a crack in it. We tried to JB weld it, which we knew was not going to work. And, but we ended up just trying it. It, uh, it did actually work for like a week, but then I guess it got hot one day and it just melted it. But it's not bad. I mean, it held for a while. Still drove. Uh, but it's, it's, it's been a good car. I've had it for almost a year. I got it December, or no, sorry, uh, the 26th, uh, the 26th. I got it, I think Thanksgiving Day last year or the day after Thanksgiving. Because we had a Christmas party at my uh, grandmother's house, and we took it there. Which was actually this house. But, anyway, that's a side point. The heck? I don't know what that was. Uh, but, anyway, so, here she is. I uh, just wanted to give you guys a little bit of update. I haven't videoed. Uh, so, the Duramax, which is my dad's 2006 3500 Dually Duramax. Has a juice attitude tuner. It's got an upgraded turbo in it. I don't really know. All right. Maybe. So anyway, uh, I've kind of lost where I was again. But so, oh yeah, the Duramax. The Duramax. So it's got an upgraded turbo. A turbo. It's got a, a juice attitude tuner. It's got a, a EGR delete. It's got a couple of pipings on it. Uh, but it's a, it's a clean truck. It's pretty fast. I mean, not fast. It, he dailies it. He did hit a Camaro 195. Uh, which is an interstate by me, which I'm sure a lot of people know. Uh, anyway, so he hit a Camaro, got a big old hole in the side. Well, anyway, one day we were going to the county fair. And we were in front of my brother's house. And my dad, he was just messing around. Had it up, cranked up. And he put it on tune 6. Which is the performance tune. Which rolls a lot of coke. 
So we were going by, sorry if I'm really shaky, it's pretty cold out here in my t-shirt. Uh, but anyway, so we were going by my brother's house, and my dad decided to, uh, lay some dual 11s. Heck. Uh, lay some dual 11s down the road. Well, let's just say that did not turn out very good. And we were like, okay, well, the trans slipped a little bit, maybe it wasn't, maybe it's something little. Well, then, this cop was down the road a little ways, uh, going to the fair, and he keeps, like, waving my dad on. And my dad's like, well, hold on, how do I get to the fair? Because they were trying to take us in a weird way. And the guy's like, keep it going, you'll know where it's at. And my dad's like, screw you. And had the tuner still cranked up, he rolled coal on him. And he's just being a total idiot, man. He just wasn't treating us right. We didn't even do anything to him. And then that's when my dad did it. Well, my dad still had it in tune six. When he did this and he forgot it to take it out, well, he stomped it and it slipped the trans and jammed back in. And that's uh, when, let's just say, we thought it broke the rear. And that's where I'm going to leave it as. And I know I've been saying on Instagram, you follow me on there, uh, Thermax underscore diesel underscore power, that we'd be talking about it, but ended up never did. But video will be coming out this Saturday. I don't know what time, but this Saturday, you guys will see a video about the Duramax and what is going on with it. Let's just say uh, things didn't turn out too good. Have a good night, guys. Peace out.